Atlanta. And joining us this morning is Congressman John Linder, Republican from Duluth, to give us some more insight into the battles brewing on Capitol Hill. Uh, Mr. Linder, good morning. Pleasure to see you. Good morning, Mark. How are you? Good, thanks. All right, let's let, let's begin with the fact that I think uh, both sides of the aisle can agree that there needs to be some reform. The, the trick is how to pay for it. Um, some say you can pay for it by cutting out the waste. Um, where do you and the rest of the Republicans stand right now? Well, I don't know where the rest of the Republicans stand, but I do know this, that the public plan is a non-starter in my view. Because if you're going to charge the company 8% of their payroll, now, if they don't have a plan, it's going to be cheaper for them to get rid of their plans and put people into the public plan. The Lewin Group, which is a very respected uh, analyst of medical issues, says that 120 million people are going to lose their, pers their personal health care coverage and move into the, into the uh, public plan. All these words of choice and options simply don't exist because your employer chooses your plan, not you. And if it's going to be in his financial interest to move you out of his plan and into the government plan, he'll do it. Right. Okay, Representative, what is the compromise here? I mean, where, where, where do we need to go? Because um, apparently all the information says that we spend about $7,900 per person on health care, which is nearly 52% more than the next costly, most costly nation in the world. So how can we find a compromise? What we have to do is bring in more competition and let the private plans compete for the number of patients. We did this with the drug benefit. If you'll recall, we, uh, we've we saved about 42% of what we thought it would cost because we allowed the pharmaceutical industries to compete for large numbers of patients using their pharmaceuticals, and it drove down the cost dramatically. We need to do that again where individuals make choices and there's private competition, not government run. All right, Congressman Linder, thanks so much for joining us this morning. We certainly appreciate Thank you. you taking the time out.